craniography is a powerful imaging technique with its principles based on the natural attenuation of radiation through matter. Although the basic principle is similar to X-ray radiography, neutrons interact with matter in a different way, therefore producing a distinct image. So, what are these neutrons? Neutrons are subatomic particles present in the nucleus, and they are characterized by having zero net charge. Since they are uncharged particles, columbic interactions do not occur when they pass through matter. Instead, they interact with the nuclei of the target materials. Neutrons are either absorbed or scattered during these instances. Because of the quantum nature of neutrons, these interactions could happen with different probabilities. This property is defined as the microscopic cross-section. Generally, the cross-section is inversely proportional to the speed of the neutron. This means that the lower the speed of a neutron, the higher is the probability for interaction. Natural attenuation of radiation through matter allows the use of the neutron beam passing through a sample to be interpreted as a signal carrying information about the composition and structure of the material. Let us now delve into the parts of the imaging chain, starting off with the neutron source. Generally, there are three types of sources of neutrons. Accelerator, radioactive materials, and nuclear reactors. In accelerator type sources, neutrons can be produced by bombarding suitable targets with positive ions. The main reaction for producing neutrons is the alpha-N reaction. On the other hand, nuclear reactors produce neutrons from uranium fission. This process yields the best quality of images owing to its high neutron flux. Moving on to the next element in the imaging chain, we have the collimator. Just like in X-ray radiography, collimators function as a beam-forming assembly. This is done through neutron moderators and neutron absorbers. After the neutron beam passes through the target, it hits the position-sensitive detector. The main purpose of the detector is to record a two-dimensional image, in other words, projection of the object. The two common detection methods are photographic detection and scintillation detection. Photographic detection is similar to X-ray detection, with an additional converter film that transforms incoming neutron radiation into alpha beta or gamma rays, which are more detectable than neutrons. After this conversion, the radiation is taken up by films with silver halide grains or structures such as an image plate. In contrast, scintillation detection uses scintillator crystals, which emit visible photons when neutrons are incident on them. These photons are then detected by a charge-coupled device and converted into the image of the sample. Neutron radiography finds numerous applications in mechanical engineering, security, electronics, medicine, biology, archaeology, and even art. Neutron radiography is used as a complementary inspection method to X-ray radiography. Because neutron beams are attenuated best by light nuclides, neutron radiography is very effective in imaging the interior of the metallic object. The 
following are sample neutron radiographs from various fields of applications.